Continue watching if you want to learn the clean case now. <coughs>
will be in contact with the roof of my mouth. See? So you should feel this sound right here on the side. It feels like it's on the side. It's not so much back of your tongue. Everybody's talking about the back of your tongue. But in my opinion, it just feels like it is here. Here, in the middle of my mouth on the side. Don't get caught up on, oh, it's very far back in your mouth. Because it's not that far back in your mouth. When you're starting this off for the first time, you're not gonna sound this clean. <coughs> you probably will sound something like maybe something like that. I can't do it as good on my left side. I saved my left side just to demonstrate how you will be sounding when you're starting this out. So I'm doing it this on my left side now. So I put my tongue up, I put it to my right side. I open up, tilt my jaw to that side. And then I make the Donald Duck sound, but inward. So as you can hear, I need kind of more room for the case now to get good. It's, it feels kind of tight right now. So that means I either got to put my tongue more away from uh, this hole or I'm going to tilt my jaw more. And that's going to take time to develop. I got to be doing it every day and very often to get it. You gotta play around a little bit with it, but that's the main way I would explain it. And just doing the inward Donald Duck sound by itself, that could help you out a lot only by itself. But you gotta make these. If you got this sound, you're on your way. You're very far on your way to get the. And this is really worth it because the case scenario is a very important sound. I believe this way of explaining it would be much more effective and I think this would actually make more people learn the case scenario for those who haven't already. When you got this clean version of a case scenario, to get it even cleaner, what you have to do is try to drop the back of your tongue as much as you can. Because if your the back of your tongue is very high up, it's gonna be like... <coughs> It's not as clean, but it's kind of clean. But if you drop it down, as you can see, it's much more clean. So that's the last tip I would give you. If you get the case now kind of decent, drop the back of your tongue. When you got this far to get the rim shot, the thing you gotta do is just do it with no air. And you hear the crisp sound when I make a case now. You gotta isolate that crispiness and you get <coughs> But that will almost come instantly after you learn the clean version of a case now because it's not very different. So a quick summary, put your tongue to the roof of your mouth, tilt it to one side, then you're gonna have to move your jaw to the opposite side and then you're gonna make the Donald Duck sound inwards on one side. Always keeping my tongue in contact with the roof of my mouth. Comment down below if you feel like you need more help and I could try to explain uh, the best I could. You could also hit me up on Instagram and I could explain to you there. Before ending, I just need to say one thing about the last video I did on Alam West Side or My Style or whatever you're gonna call it. I got some complaints saying that I was doing the routine wrong and I am pretty thankful as well that some guys said I was doing it wrong so I could correct it. Looking into it I saw yeah maybe the bass that I'm doing in the video is not that accurate. However the tutorial in my opinion is still a great way to learn Alam West Side even though the bass might not be accurate. I'm just gonna show you now how you're gonna do the bass. It's not a, that big of a change to be honest. It's just making the bass kind of more in one unit and a bit, little bit longer and that's kind of changes the timing. So I will explain and show how I mean. So in the video I explained to you guys that you're supposed to do <laughs> 
Opangannem tal bin But instead Alam actually does it like this I hope you can hear the difference between those two and understand the difference and I hope you can also see that the later one sounds better, it's more flow in that later version. This is how I think Alam does it and when comparing me to him I don't see too many differences when we both make West Side or my style or whatever you want to call it. So I think that's the right way. Don't take my words for that this is the exact way of doing it. I did my best to copy Alam and I gave you a tutorial on it and that's not much more than that. It's just my interpretation and that interpretation might not always be exactly right. But I hope a lot of times it will actually be pretty accurate. With that being said, I hope you enjoyed this video, like, comment and also hit that notification bell below and share the video and as always, my name is Kirby and I am out.